Move over, Hollywood drama queens! Black China is here to take center stage with her jaw-dropping transformation. And guess what? Khloe Kardashian exposes the mind-blowing reason behind Black China's transformative facade. With more changes than a chameleon on a fashion runway, this reality star has taken the art of reinvention to a whole new level. But is Black China really on a journey of self-reinvention, or is she faking some carefully crafted branding drama? Let's delve into all the scandalous details surrounding her eyebrow-raising evolution. You may know her as Angela Renee White, but her stage name is Black China, and she's one fierce mama. This bombshell was born on May 11, 1988, and she's been making moves ever since. First off, China started her career as a stripper before transitioning into modeling. She's worked with several big-name brands and has appeared in music videos for artists like Nicki Minaj and Future. China hit the big time when she was cast as the lead in Tyga's Rack City music video, and it wasn't long after that that she started dating the rapper and accepted his proposal. The two lovebirds had a son together named King Cairo Stevenson, but sadly, their romance came to an end in 2014. China bounced back in a big way. She then launched her own online boutique called 88 Fin and even started her own makeup brand and salon called Lashed by Black China. This mama that everybody loves is a big boss. And speaking of love, China started dating Rob Kardashian in 2016, and things moved pretty fast. Within three months of dating, they were engaged, and if that wasn't enough, the couple announced that they were expecting a baby girl together just a month later. Who knew what was next for this power couple? Eventually, this relationship gave way to her foray into reality TV. China has appeared on several shows, including Keeping Up with the Kardashians and her own show, Rob and China. Nothing stopped Black China. But what really sets China apart was her commitment to philanthropy. She's involved in several charitable causes, including working with Amber Rose Slutwalk, an organization that aims to end rape culture, victim blaming, and slut shaming. But hold your contour brushes, folks. The real scoop behind Black China's mind-boggling transformation is the talk of the town. Well, well, it seems like some serious tea is being spilled about Black China's transformation. Rumor has it that she's not being genuine about it. And who's spreading these rumors? None other than the Kardashians themselves, with Khloe leading the charge. Ooh, drama. Let's discuss the juicy feud between Black China and the Kardashian family. It all started back in 2016 when China began dating Rob Kardashian. At the time, Rob's little sis, Kylie Jenner, was dating China's ex-boyfriend and baby daddy, Tyga. Black China's life is already a roller coaster ride, and now she's hitched a crazy Kardashian train? It's like like mixing gasoline with fireworks and hoping for a peaceful sparkler show. Chaos was practically guaranteed. Of course, the media went wild with speculation that China was only using Rob to get back at the Kardashians. But it wasn't just the media that was concerned. The Kardashians themselves were reportedly worried about Rob's mental health and well-being. Fast forward to 2017, when things really went downhill. Rob and China had a major public breakup, with Rob accusing China of cheating and posting scandalous photos of her on social media. China even had had to get a restraining order against him. And since the Kardashians were involved, the drama just won't end. China filed a lawsuit against Rob and several members of the Kardashian family, alleging that they had conspired to cancel her reality show, Rob and China. The lawsuit was eventually dismissed, but the feud between China and the Kardashians rages on. In fact, China has even gone so far as to accuse the Kardashian family of being racist and trying to ruin her career. And while the Kardashians haven't said much about the situation publicly, it's clear that there's no love lost between these two parties. According to TMZ, Chloe stated that she was worried about the outrageous, chaotic, violent behavior that came along with their relationship. She also hinted that the drama between Rob and China caused some major problems on keeping up with the Kardashians. During the trial, the Strong Looks Better Naked author spoke about China's alleged dangerous behavior toward her brother, Rob. But that's not all. The jury was also presented with some emails that supposedly showed the Kardashian family's frustration with China. In one email, Chloe even hinted that they might not continue with their own show if China China's reality series continued. During her court appearance, Khloe Kardashian did not deny sending emails regarding Black China, but clarified that she was referring to Rob Kardashian's relationship with China, not the reality show. China sued the Kardashian-Jenner family for $100 million, claiming that they were responsible for the cancellation of her and Rob's show, Rob and China. Kim Kardashian, on the other hand, claimed that she couldn't remember specific details during her testimony, but clarified that when she said China can never be on her show, she actually meant KUWTK. The jury also learned that Chloe and Kylie expressed concern about their brother and his show with China and wanted it to be canceled after an alleged physical altercation between the former couple. However, the former vice president of development and programming at E, Jeff Old, testified that the family's emails did not influence the network's decision to cancel the show. Black China, who has a daughter named Dream with Rob, seek $36 million in damages for emotional distress after their show, Rob and China, was canceled. The couple dated on and off for a year before calling it quits in February 2017. 
2017. Now, going back to her transformation, Black China recently announced that she has deactivated her OnlyFans account, which reportedly earned her $240 million in 2021. During an appearance on The Jason Lee Show on Revolt, China explained, I'm changing everything about me. All that stuff is a dead end, and I know that I'm worth way more than that. She cited the legal issues she's had and her desire to set a good example for her children as reasons for leaving the platform. Despite this, China expressed support for those who are still earning money on OnlyFans. Shout out to the people that do still have their OnlyFans and stuff like that. Get your money, but don't let the money control you. China also discussed her $100 million defamation lawsuit against the Kardashians, stating, Thank God that I did sue the Kardashians, regardless of the outcome. I stood up for myself because there were layers to it. Although China lost the lawsuit, she felt vindicated for taking on the famous family. When asked about a potential apology from Kris Jenner, China joked, Honestly, I don't care about nobody's apologies, unless it comes with a Ferrari. Then I'll take it. Looks like we're totally on the same page, China. Or should I call you Angela? Our thoughts align when it comes to this. We should start a support group, Ferrari Apology Club, where sorry comes with speed. Black China also shared her thoughts on her previous appearance, admitting that she thinks her face looked crazy before she dissolved her fillers. In an Instagram video, after celebrating her 35th birthday, China reflected on her old photos and commented on the changes she had made. She even shared an old photo and said, the face was looking crazy. The model added that the photo was taken a few months before she had all the fillers removed and had a major transformation. She reflected on her decision to remove all her facial fillers and stated that she believes her face looked crazy before the procedure. She shared in an Instagram video, I was looking at old pictures, you guys. That face was looking crazy. That first picture, that was like a few months before I took out all the filler. China urged her followers to avoid getting fillers on their faces, stating that it wasn't worth it and that her current look was much better. She also revealed that she had gotten silicone injections on her butt and breast implants, but had also removed all of those modifications from her body in March. China explained that she wanted to return to her baseline look and be back to being Angela, her real name. Now Black China is making positive changes in her life and trying to improve herself, which is great to see. However, there are some who just can't seem to be happy about it. And by some means THE Kardashians. Seems like they just can't handle anyone else being the center of attention for too long. There's a theory going around online that Black China China's latest move is her biggest scam yet. People are saying that her new change is all about her obsession with the Kardashians and wanting to be like them. Some folks pointed out how coincidental it is that she's removing her fillers and BBL at the same time as the Kardashians. Apparently, the Kardashians secretly got butt reductions, and now people are questioning the timing of China's transformation. According to an insider, Chloe thinks that Black China's transformation is all about money. Apparently, China isn't ranking in as much dough as she used to, so she's trying to switch things up and find a new gig to make even more cash. And people are buying into it. But Chloe isn't fooled. She sees right through the so-called new person act. So get this, Chloe thinks that Black China's whole I'm a new person now act is just a money-making scheme. And you know what? People are falling for it. Chloe's like, come on, who's she fooling? She's also calling China out for not fully committing to her new identity. Even though she wants to be called Angela White now, Chloe says she's still holding on to the name Black China just to make a quick buck. Fans say that if China was serious about this change, she wouldn't keep the name around just for financial gain. But whether it's real or not, one thing's for sure, it's got people talking. Do you think China or Angela White is transforming for the better? Let me know your thoughts.